Hi, I'm Mike from Scoutadelic, and how can you make a robotic hand? Find out. Hi, I'm Mike from Scoutadelic, and today I'm going to show you how to make a robotic hand. <laughs> Um, it's very simple to do. It's really good to talk about it because you can use this for uh, like a digital maker or some really fun sciencey type things. So what you're going to need is you're going to need some corrugated cardboard, going to need some string, scissors, straw and some tape. First of all is you're going to get the young people to put their hands on the corrugated card and you want them to space out their fingers so they can obviously draw around it and then they're going to cut it out. Then when you've got your hand what you want to do is for each of the fingers you want to mark them off so they have like sort of three sections. If you notice you've got obviously the top, you've got this middle bit and then you've got this bit okay. So that's the idea all right. So you're going to mark them on your fingers and with the thumb you're only doing one two, two there okay. Then what you want to do with the scissors is you want to gently score them so that they you're not going to cut them all but they will bend on those lines. Then what you want to do is with your straw you're going to cut little sections so that they will fit in the little sections on your fingers. So about that size will be perfectly fine for this. And then what you're going to do is you're going to stick each of these onto each of the different segments. So you should have around about 14 of these. So it should look like that. Then with your string you're going to measure out five strands at 30 centimeters. And when you've got those strands each strand represents a hand. So what you're going to do is you're going to thread it through your straw and then attach it to the top of each of your fingers. So like that. And then once you've got all your strings you're going to pierce a hole into the center of the hand. And then each of the strings is going to go through that hole and then you're going to tie it on the other end. So now all the strings are going through one hole and at the end of this you want to tie them all together so that they don't obviously come back through the hole. And there we are. You have your own robotic hand. That when you tug certain bits of the string. Hey. Now what you could do with this is also to be part of like the digital maker you can make commands so that you know that you can maybe try and pick things up with the hands. It's also really cool to show obviously how the hand works on all the different muscles and things like that inside. It's just a simple thing of tugging a bit of string. And there we have it really cool robotic hands that you can obviously use as a fun way of showing what your hand is like inside but also it's really fun to do for like uh, a game or things like that. If you like this video then don't forget to obviously give it a thumbs up <laughs> and share it around otherwise I'll see you again soon for another one of these. Bye!